Alright, today I'm just gonna show you how to um set up um set up your Chromecast. I don't know if it's you know what I'm videoing it myself so I don't know if it's gonna show good or not. I don't even know if it's catching my face or not. Anyway, my face isn't important now anyway still it's um it's the um Chromecast I'm gonna show you how to set up your Chromecast, yeah? So okay, well I buy this Chromecast, um wait, here it is. And I just literally just take it out of the box. Um here just now um so as it can imagine i'm using one hand to do all of this now so uh here we go it's kind of, that's a chromecast that's what that's that's why it's gonna cast basically your movies or whatever stream from your phone or from your ipod or from your whatever and so i just open the box as i say i see you got the with the H, hdmi little lead bit there to plug into your tv then you got the plug well this is a UK version so, um, and also you got a extension but if your T if you can't really fit onto your TV properly um, there we go I won't be needing that today and then you got the the cables for the to plug to use the plug okay so um let's go ahead then and Try to set it up. Um, today I'm just gonna set it up to my TV. Then, I plug. All you need to do is just plug this bit into your, into the Chromecast, and that's the lead there. Now I'm gonna go ahead and plug it into, into the actual wall plug onto here. Yeah. So now I've plugged it in. Um, and you can see there's a steady, a flashing red light on it. Hopefully you guys can see that, and it's flashing. So I'm just gonna now plug it into the the TV and then put it to the HDMI, which um, whichever compatible with your one. So plug it straight into your HDMI. Um, it's just behind my TV here, guys. Yeah, so that's now in, and as you can see, this is a steady red light. Now it's it's a steady um, white light. So I'm just going to go use the TV remote and I'm going to change it to the relevant HDMI. So in my case it's HDMI 2. And it should say do that guys. Okay so it says welcome to get, welcome to get started download Google app and so forth. So I've downloaded um, Google, Google Home. So, what you need to do now is tap on it. Okay, open up there. Good. So, the next thing you're going to do is cl click on the, um, this button here. This free little button there. So, go, go ahead and click on that. And then... Okay, and then you're going to go devices. You see where it says add devices there. So you go ahead and click add new device. Okay. So exactly what it says there. Connect to your device in Wi-Fi setting for setup. Your device has created a temporary Wi-Fi. Blah, 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 blah. Read that through that. Um, tap the home button and go to the iPad setting Wi-Fi. Connect to the Wi-Fi hotspot for the device that you are setting up. It will have a four digit number on the end, like example, like that one. So, okay, let's do that then. So, I'm gonna tap on in this. In my case, I'm using the iPad, so I'm gonna tap on it. Go to your Wi Fi setting then. Okay, there you go, guys. So, you got, you got it there. So, you tap on it. And it's gonna try to connect. Okay. It says security recommendation, but that's now connected. So from your setting, guys, you're gonna go back onto the um, touch back, go back onto the the Google Home. In my case is just run here, Google Home again, and that you will see this bit there. It's gonna ask you to continue. Continue. 
and it's now searching it says successfully connected there you go and there you go and it's asking you here do you see the code on your TV the code is and it tell you that that blah 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 so as you can see it's just there and mine there and yes I could see it just go continue and there you go and this is where you can change the name guys um so I, I, I'm gonna keep mine that one just there and I might just change it to um four two four eight I'm gonna put um Mac just put Mac um you can put whatever name you like guys um and just press continue and it will keep saying continue oh there you go so when you get to this stage guys um what you need to do is select a wi-fi network so you click on it and you search for your wi-fi okay search for your wi-fi network there we go i'm just gonna connect my one i can't show you what my password is and then hit continue sorry about the light in there in there and it's just now searching oh it just now keeps searching and searching and searching Chromecast, 428, Mac, and the pin, and all that thing there. So, guys, now just go to your, I don't know, a YouTube video or so, or something, something of whatever. Just go to YouTube, and um, all you need to do is just click on this, this button right here. See? I don't know and just type something onto the search bar so I'm gonna type something onto the search bar now um, I don't know BMW go for BMW thing whatever that is and so whatever you do on your TV it will come up in a minute so I'm gonna click onto a video and let's go on to a video so there you go See, whatever is happening there, that's the exact thing happened on your TV there. So guys, if you like this video, share it and give me a thumbs up. Yeah. The last thing is, if you want to come out of it, all you need to do is click click on there, and it will come up disconnect, and you just click disconnect. There you go. And that's your TV back onto it.